What is up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you a very special recipe. Now, it's probably the easiest recipe I've ever brought to you. It only takes two ingredients, but here's the kicker, right? You guys know that I've talked about it before. I'm not a big banana fan, and one of those two ingredients is bananas. So we are gonna see, this might be the first taste test video ever to not get a seal of approval at the end. So anyways, I'm a little excited, a little nervous, <laughs> kind of like I'm taking a date to prom for the first time. But uh, I'm gonna get over my fear and we're gonna get these things a shot So if you're ready to see how to make two ingredient protein pancakes, then uh, stay tuned because we're gonna get it done Let's do it! Guys, the camera literally fell there at the end and I had to catch it. It almost broke, but I caught it. So right at the end of my spiel too. So I'm just gonna leave it in because I thought it was funny and it's real. So anyways, hopefully you got a laugh out of that. So the only two ingredients we are gonna need today are some bananas and some eggs. For this recipe in particular, we're gonna need a blender. You don't need a blender, you can blend it yourself, but this will make it a little easier. So I have a food processor because I don't have a tiny blender, but this should do the trick. So I'm gonna use both of these bananas. We're also gonna need four eggs. So let's get started. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and take the lid off the blender. I'm gonna start adding the ingredients in. This is so easy that I figured, hey, we'll just uh, add them straight into the bowl here instead of mixing them up first. So we need four eggs. I'm gonna go ahead and tap these bad boys and put them in here. I do have a trash can right here next to me that I'm going to be throwing these shells in. So I'm not just throwing them on the floor in case you were wondering. Remington likes to live a little cleaner than that. All right, four eggs are in there. Now on to the next ingredient, we're gonna go ahead and use these two bananas. Now I have never peeled a banana before in my life, so I don't even know how this works. You start at the top? How do you, man, I, maybe I should have practiced. You rip this, oh, guys, we're learning. We're learning, oh, this doesn't smell very good. Eek, and the texture, and the shape, the shape. <laughs> Ew, what's this? Does that go in there or not? The black stuff, do I peel that away? I, I'm just going to, I'm just gonna do that. Ew, do these things poop? Okay, get that off of there. Oh, this smells awful. Okay, um, I don't know what I'm doing. We're just gonna put it in there. All right, next one. Hey guys, at least I'm getting good at peeling them. Okay, open, sesame, black spots. What are these? What are you? All right, we're just gonna put that in there. All right, ingredients all done. Let me get this off of here, and then uh, we're gonna blend it. All right, go ahead and put this lid on, and we're gonna blend up our ingredients. All right, guys, I think we are good and blended. Oh, I'm just not a fan of the way that looked. Guys, I don't have very high, uh, I don't have very high expectations for this at all. Oh man, okay. Well, this part's done. All right, and the next part, guys, we're gonna go ahead and take our cooking spray here and hit the pan with it. Make sure we get a nice coating. We do not want these to stick. All right, bingo, that's good. And the next thing we're gonna wanna do is take our batter, right, that we've made and dump just a little bit on here. There we go. You wanna keep these thin or so I've heard. It makes them cook a little better. So we're gonna go ahead and do, uh, that's like a pancake football right there, but hey. All right, we'll let that sit. Now apparently these don't take very long to cook, guys. This is my first time doing this, so I guess we're kinda of playing this together. All right, so it's been a couple minutes. Let me see, how's that looking here? Still a little droopy. I heard these are pretty fragile, so you gotta be careful when you flip them. Let's see what we got. Can I get, can I, can I flip you yet? Looks dangerous. Okay, come on. Grab. You, this thing just does not want me to get in there. Okay, hold up, hold up. Do we, oh, oh, we tore it. We tore it. Okay, well, the side looks done here. What, little finger magic, bah, okay. Well, starting to look more like a hash brown than anything, but I think we're getting there. All right, what about this one? Can we flip you? Okay, that's just draining all off the top. Really working good. Okay, flip you. All right, so far it's a disaster, guys. So far, we are failing at this cooking video. Oh, man. Well, bone appetit. <laughs> bone apple teeth. <laughs> okay, okay, I thought this one's done. We're gonna whip all of these up, by the way, so maybe I'll get better as I go. Maybe, you know what, instead of doing two, let's make one big one. How about that? Let's make one big one. Well, I will say guys, they smell better now that they're cooked and they do, they look a lot like actual pancakes. All right, let's give this another shot. Hold on, let's hit it with the spray just in case. Okay, there we go. Let's do a big in. 
There we go. See how that fares. All right, the big one might be a little better. We're gonna do a little experiment. We're gonna put the lid on it and see if that helps this thing cook through a little faster. All right, let's check on it. Ooh, okay, this one looks like it's good to be flipped. Wonder how hard it's gonna be to flip this big, big bad boy. Whoa, okay, it's falling apart. All right, we're just gonna cut this thing in the half, down the middle, and flip the half. All right, come on, I get some finger magic in here. All right, this is a, uh, whoa, okay, whoa, ah, oh. All right, epic fail once again. Ah, oh, ah, hot. Well, guys, I'm not very good at this whole flipping thing. If you have any suggestions on how to do these better in the future, comment below, because uh, these are not really looking like pancakes, really. All right, so that'll round that one off, I guess. All right, final pancake, I don't even care. Dump it all in there, let's get this done. All right guys, we were at the final bit of these pancakes and maybe I got a tiny bit better at it, but still that is pretty uh, pretty bad. So I don't know if I had a bigger pan or what I would have to do for these to not fall apart. So I'm gonna finish these up, put them on the plate and then we will do a taste test and see how they turned out. All right guys, we have ourselves the world's least prettiest protein pancakes, but check those out, right? I think even though they aren't pretty, I mean, I still cooked them right, so Regardless of how they look, they should taste at least all right if they're decent, right? So disclaimer, like I said, I'm not a big banana fan, so I'm gonna be 100% honest with you guys on these. I'm not really excited for it, but we shall see. We get ourselves a little bite here. Okay, that's what I'm doing. There we go, check it out. So that's gonna be the bite we are about to put in our mouth. <laughs> all right, you guys ready? Three, I'm, ner I'm nervous, I'm nervous, I'm nervous. Two, one, go! Nope, nope, <laughs> not doing it guys, not doing it. I'm throwing every one of these away. Ah, ah, that was terrible. Hold on, I'll try one of the fresh ones that's still smoking to see if it's any better, but uh, I have my doubts. Best place for these guys. <laughs> ah, we are back. <laughs> oh, those were terrible. Those were terrible. Um, there's macros for those somewhere. Hold on, let me let me get the macros. And even though I'm never, ever, 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 ever in the history of ever going to make those again, some of you guys, if you like bananas, I mean, they tasted like bananas, kinda. So, um, eh, if you like bananas, give them a try. Comment below, let me know what you think. And uh, you know, I've seen so many people make those, and uh, you know, they love them, they swear by them. They're like, you should really try those, Ram. I'm like, okay, I'll try them. No, that was terrible. That was the worst idea I've had in a long time. So, <laughs> anyways guys, I'm gonna give you the overall total macros here. That makes, we'll just say that makes roughly four pancakes. It's kind of what I made. So all in all for that, you have 19 grams of fat, you got 27 grams of protein and 55 grams of carbohydrates. Total calorie count is 496. Now, if you wanted to get crafty and split that into two servings, you'd be at about 9.5 grams of fat, 13.5 grams of protein and 27 and a half grams of carbs for two servings. So, I mean, nutrient wise, you get six grams of fiber in the total thing. Um, I can see that being a good option for somebody, but boy, not for me, not for me. I feel like that entire video was destined to fail from the beginning. Like the camera falls in the beginning, the, uh, the cooking went terrible, the uh, taste test, uh, no. No, <laughs> so um, for anybody saying that I always give everything a good taste test. No, I don't, false, false. So that's that guys. I apologize if this wasn't a very informative cooking video, but uh, I kept getting messages saying, hey, you should make these, you should make these. They're simple, they're simple. I made them, so there you go. <laughs> There you go. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So anyways, that is going to wrap up this cooking video. Um, I did get another recipe. Shout out to my dude, Ollie. He hooked me up with another recipe that is pretty simple, almost as simple as that one, but there's no banana. So that's probably gonna be the next pancake recipe you see. But anyways, try these. Let me know. Comment below what you think. And uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, but no. Yeah, but no, not again. So 
Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed this video, whether or not that was a total epic fail on my part, hit that like button, comment below. Thank you guys so much for all the support and everything. You guys rock. You guys really help let me do what I do on a daily basis. So, by the way, real quick, head on over to my Instagram at the Remington James. I'm doing a giveaway right now. You still have a few days to enter it. So, if you follow me on Instagram, check out my most recent post. Uh, there might be a post ahead of that now, but uh, check it out. And uh, there's going to be a picture of a hat and a pre workout if you want to win. I'm choosing three winners. So, anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, as always, to smile, remain positive, and paste them on the comment because you never know whose day you can make it better. With that, I am out of here. This has been a Remington James production. I will see you guys at the next video. See you later.